When visitors come to Old Sacramento, they come for the shops, the restaurants, the history. But in the fall, when the sun begins to set over the Sacramento River and the shadows lengthen in Old Town, that's the time you're bound to hear a ghost story or two. They tell them down here, you know, at places like Evangeline's, where customers aren't allowed downstairs. This basement is very legendary with hunting activity. There's just something about this place, something creepy. They called it the dungeon for fun, to tease new employees, and everybody was very frightened because it was really dark and dank down here. Initially a war in a very small rooms, the basement now houses shipping and receiving. And yet, perhaps because of beams that came from an old-time sailing ship, that feeling doesn't go away. People have been followed into the restroom, thought there was somebody behind them. Somebody or something. He scared me. And we haven't even been upstairs yet. Years ago, the third floor was a disco. And sometimes, when that area is closed and empty, had people working on the second floor hear music and partying going up on the third floor when there was nobody present at all. Others have seen weird flickering lights, and there are tales of objects levitating. But our guide Shannon says she hasn't seen any ghosts, at least that she admits to. I thought I saw something out of the corner of my eye a couple times, but I just knocked on wood and kept on walking. But if she walked down the street to Fanny Ann's, she would simply have walked into another ghost story. And while a sign out front promises spirits of only the finest qualitative prominence, we don't think all the ghosts here are high class. There is the story of the old time saloon girl. She was sitting right here at this bar and she was being very flirtatious this, this one evening back in the 1800s. And was shot by a jealous boyfriend. Now, sometimes late at night, people swear to a ghostly visitor. You're not scared, are you? Then follow us to Vegas, where the ghost of the so-called vampire of Sacramento is said to lurk in the shadows. Years ago, this was a night spot called Steamboat Navigation. There was a gentleman who used to frequent here. Well, he wasn't really a gentleman. He was actually a serial killer. It does make a difference, you know. You kind of feel oddball feelings in certain areas of the bar. Or leaning against the walls. Yeah, Old Sacramento is incredibly haunted. There's so many areas. But we don't really believe that, do we? In Old Sacramento, Jonathan Mum, News 10.